Hey guys, Harsh Gwints here. Welcome back to the Knights of the Old Republic playthrough. Uh, last week, we turned in some bounties, found the hidden Bex, uh, explored Underworld Terrace, or Undercity of Terrace, and found out that Mission Veo's Wookiee friend Zalbar has been captured. So before we can continue that story and find Zalbar, we are going to go into another... Uh, my mouse is not the correct mouse. That was weird. Um, we are going to do another uh, arena fight and hopefully win. And then we'll do a game of Pazak and hopefully win that too because we still need to do that if we look up in our uh, mission thing. We've got to finish Pazak. So we'll talk to this guy, Jur. Ah, mysterious stranger, I knew you'd be back. They all come back. I'll just get this. You want to set up, set up another fight, right? The ring is in your blood now like a virus. You need to hear the cheers of the crowd. You need the rush of the battle. You need to fight again. You want to step in the ring now? Are you ready to prove yourself against the best duelist on Terrace? I'm ready for a duel. I think you're ready to go against Ice, human. She's tough, but so are you. There will be lots of action on this fight. A huge purse. You ready? Let's do it. Ladies and gentlemen, draw your eyes to the center ring. We have a very special presentation in store for you. Over in this corner, a woman with steel on her bones and ice water in her veins. She's cold and quick as death itself. You know her. You love her. Ice. And in the other corner, a rising star taking that first step into the big league. I give you the mysterious stranger. Hopefully we can win this. Um, she has a... Let's do a poison grenade. And then we'll... Do I do a flurry attack? You're alright, dude. So now that we poison her, hopefully she'll just take damage every time. Oh, she's going to have to be Damn. I got messed up. Good job. It's over! The fight is over! The mysterious stranger has won! Ice is knocked out cold! Looks like we have a rising star in the mysterious stranger, folks. But how high can this star soar? You'll just have to watch and see. Good. We won that. Pretty easily. Let's go collect our uh, credits. Good fight. Good fight. People like you. People. All right. We've done that. I was paying my debts. Cool. We'll set up another fight next week. I think there should be this old guy. I think this old guy and this Rodian over here. What's this guy named? Twitch. Um, so let's go do a Pazak game real quick. Uh, hopefully, I'll just probably run through it, but I just want to get the W. Where the hell? Oh, here's the door. Hello, Niklos. Pazak is not for everyone. It requires both nerve and skill. Perhaps you should try. Okay, let's play. Shut up. I'm going to enjoy the... Right. Uh, so I'll wager this. Let's stand. Hopefully we can get this. Damn it. God damn it. Fazak Fuck. Is not. Shut up. Alright, I'm gonna go pick up um, my companions because I left them there. So I'm gonna return the hideout. hideout and uh, what we're gonna do next is the Rat Cool Serum since we picked up a sample of the Rat Cool Serum. So we will give that to what's his name. And we have all these bounties to turn in. Which Dia we have to tell, tell her about. But these other two... Selvin we can turn in still and the dual ring is ongoing. So we're gonna I'm gonna go get my companions and I will see you when we're talking to Dia. Alright guys, we're back in the apartment. Um I forgot about this, but there's some upgrades that we can do. So we're gonna upgrade Kart's blaster real quick. We'll just equip these, assemble them, close. Can we upgrade this at all? We'll do ours real quick. Nothing there. Uh and can we do our armor? Yes, we can. So we'll assemble that. All right, cool. So now we're just going to 
take that I'll take them with us possibly so add and add all right next up on the list to do is we got to go find Dia and she is, is this Dia yep you're back did you did you manage to get Holden to withdraw the price on my head uh, I spoke with Holden I convinced him to remove the bounty on your head he, he called the bounty off that's wonderful. I only wish I had something to give you as a reward. Wait a minute, I know. I don't have many credits, but there is something I can give you. It's a family heirloom. It's not much, but it's something. Uh, keep your reward, dear. Helping you was thanks enough. I can never truly repay you for helping me, but you'll always have my thanks for what you did. Ooh, and mission leveled up. So let's level up mission real quick. What? Uh, we'll level her up. Skills. Alright, so she is, I think, what is she? I should tell us, right? Um, she's a scoundrel, so she gets a lot of points. Let's just do demolition for her. And I guess security. And I guess treat injury. And we got one more point. Let's just do awareness, I guess. I don't really use it that much. So features, or feats. Sneak attack. Okay. I don't know what that is. Um, so she is... What did I say? She's one-handed? Right? I forget what I did last week for her. Yeah, she's one-handed. Let's do... She has a like, unique viral blade. So we'll do um, this one bonus to melee. We'll accept that. And we'll switch back to our guy. So next up is... We need to go and talk to the guy who was holding the Republic uh, troops, because he will, um, yeah, this location. He will, he has, we can give him the serum. Sorry, I don't know what I'm trying to say. We'll give him the serum. All these people that the game wants us to, I don't know why it's, see like now the mouse is fine, but it's occasionally switching to uh, the other one. So we don't want to talk to this guy. Hey, Carl. You're a pilot for the Republic, right? You've been all over the galaxy, I bet, right? So tell me, how would you rate Taurus compared to other worlds you've seen? To be honest, Mission, Terrace would rate pretty low. The prejudice, the rich spoiling themselves while the poor are crushed beneath them. It's not a good picture. Yeah, but that's only since the Sith occupation. Before that, well, I guess it wasn't all that different, really. Hmm, maybe Taurus ain't as great as I thought, you know? Trust me, Mission, there are a lot of worlds better than Terrace. There, there are worse, too, but Terrace is no place for a kid to live on her own. Even a kid who's got a Wookiee to look out for. Hey, I ain't no kid. I look out for Zalbar as much as he looks out for me. Big C's my friend, not my babysitter. Jeez, I come ask you a question, you give me a lecture. Don't you snap at me, Missy. You want a lecture? How's this? Only bratty little children fly off the handle because of a simple comment. Settle down right now, both of you. I don't have to listen to you, Car. You ain't my father, though you're sure old enough to be. So keep your lectures inside your withered old head, because I don't need them. And I sure as hell don't need this. Look, let's just drop it and get back to what we were doing. All right, you two. Sassy pants. All right, so if we talk to this guy, he should be able to... Welcome back. Are you in need of healing or medical supplies? I can treat you right here at the center for almost any condition, except the Rakul disease, of course. Um, I have the serum to cure the Rakul disease. You have the serum? Impossible. How did you get this? No, wait, I don't really want to know. Can, can I see it? The serum, I mean? I need to see if there is enough for me to analyze it so I can start producing it in mass quantities. Here you go. Hmm, let me see. Yes, this is it. A cure for the Rakul disease. With this sample, I can make enough serum for everyone. The people of Terrace owe you a debt they can never repay. Please, take this small reward. It isn't much, but it's all I can afford. A few credits and two spare med packs. Um, keep your reward, Zelka. You, uh, actually, we'll take it. Thank you, Zelka. That, that would be fine. I appreciate everything you've done. There are many who would have sold the serum to the crime lord Davik for a much higher sum. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? Um, uh, I'll be going now. Goodbye, and good health to you. 
If you ever need any medical aid or treatment, you know where to find me. So we got all that stuff. Um, so let's look at our quest real quick that we have. You blew it! If you'd brought that rat ghoul serum to Zax, you would have made it worth your while. But no, you had to go and do the honorable thing. All right, guy. Uh, so let's see what's next. So we have Rukul's Apprentice. That's Undercity. Search for Basila. We can turn that one in now. Bendak, we have to. That's going to be one that we work on. Fuck Bazak. Um, and you discovered that carved. So this is something we'll do over time. So the next one, I guess, is Rukil and searching for Bastila. So we're just going to go down to the lower city. And I will see y'all when we're at Javiar's Cantina. So I'll see you then. Uh, hey, Karth. Can I, can I talk to you for a second? Are you ready to have a civil chat? Or is this going to be another childish tantrum? Tantrum? I'm trying to apologize, you nerf herder. Ugh, I mean, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to get mad at you. It's just that I'm sick of everyone treating me like I'm a helpless kid. Yeah, I know. And I'm I'm sorry about what I said, too. I'm just a little on edge lately. Not surprising, considering all we've been through. But I shouldn't take it out on you. It's about time you two made up. Mission, you have to know that we don't think you're helpless. I mean, look where we are. Look at what we're doing. You're not just along for the ride. We need you. You really mean it, don't you? Nobody's ever said anything like that to me before. Not even Big Z. He might think it, but he's not really one for words, you know. Thanks, Karth. Well, that's no big deal. I, mean, I know it is. Sometimes you just need to hear a few words of encouragement. Kids are like that. Kids are like that? Listen, you... <laughs> oh, I get it. Okay, you got me. You're pretty funny, Karth. For an old guy. Come on, geezer. Let's get back to what we were doing. All right. So this time I will see you, unless we have another interruption, but I'll see you at Javier's Cantina. Alright guys, we're in a fight now. I just came down here. Um, I also was stopped by the Sith guy at the... Uh... Oh, I need to put on her sword. Um, I was stopped by the Sith guy at the elevator to come down to the lower city. Because we didn't have our suit. So, um... But he stopped us and we just showed him the papers. So I'm not going to include that. Obviously. But. Come on, guys. Good job. Oh, are we fighting more people? You are. Wow. I've never really been this active when we're like supposed to be searching for BZ. Good hit, I guess. That Twi'lek's been surged. I don't know. I hate that that it does this. I need to find a way to turn down the uh, gun volume because there's like... Alright, game. Huh? That's cool. Freeze me up. Alright, we'll just continue what? from here uh, and just go to Javier's. So what we're doing is turning in Selvin's bounty, which we did last week. Uh, we just She was just hanging out in an apartment. And then we'll go to the lower city. We're, there's uh, some people that we can give the Rackle Serum to because we have it. So that shouldn't be too big of an issue. Um, and then we are going to continue for Big Z and look for that guy, the, uh, that guy's apprentice. Or we found the apprentice, but we need to find some other stuff, so we'll have to come back for that. I'm not really too worried about it. And here's Zax. So we'll come in and turn it in. Back again, human. I hope you didn't come just to chat. Davik hired me to do business and make credits, not to make small talk. I've got a bounty I wanted to collect on. A bounty? Well, human, that is what I'm here for. Which bounty are you here to collect on? Tell him about Selvin. So Selvin's dead. All the other bounty hunters who went after her ended up dead themselves, you know? You did well, human. Here's 300 credits. That's the price for all bounties. I want 400 credits for this job. You're brave, human. It's a bargain with a hut, but I like you. Okay. 400 it is. You do good work, human. There's a lot of bounty hunters on Terrace, but most are lazy. Maybe if you keep catching bounties, they'll work harder. Alright, I'll be going. Bye, human. You come back if you want to earn credits. Okay, we've seen all that. So, like, stuff like that I'm going to try and just skip through. Um, so, yeah, now we'll just go back to Undercity. Or, uh, Under... I keep calling it Underworld because of... Uh, the Underworld and the Fallout series, but we'll just go there. So, um, last week we've met the the Hidden Bex, which was led, and so we're trying to go f 
find. So if we f help help mission take to get to Big Z, she'll help us get to the what are they called? The Black Volkers. Yeah, we're gonna get to the Black Vol Volkers um, group or whatever. So or their hidden base. So that hopefully won't be too difficult, but who knows? Um, I don't know who I'm gonna take because you can only have two companions at once. I wish you could have three. Mission seems rather distant. Maybe you should talk to her. Uh, let's speak to Mission. Hey there. What can I do for you? Uh, I want to know a little bit more about you, Mission. Really? You want to know about me? Nobody's ever really been interested in me before. What do you want to know? Uh, how did you and Zalbar hook up? Big Z's my family, you know. My parents. Well, I, I guess they're dead. It was just me on my own until the day I saw Zalbar in the lower city. I could tell right away he was in trouble. This was before the gang wars were out of hand. But even then, the Volkers were scum. A few of them were hassling Big Z, trying to pick a fight, but he wasn't looking for trouble. Uh, who'd want to pick a fight with a Wookiee? Hey, nobody said the Volkers were smart, but there were three of them, so maybe they figured they could handle him. I don't know. Anyway, I don't like the Volkers at the best of times. And when I saw them picking on this poor Wookiee, all alone on a strange planet, overwhelmed by the big city, I just lost it. I screamed out, leave him alone, you core slimes! and charged right at them. Well, one of them saw me coming and slapped me so hard he just about knocked me cold. Um, smacking a kid? Those Volkers have no class. Actually, they'll piss her off. Um, you're lucky he didn't try to fry you with a blaster. Hey, I don't need a lecture from you. You ain't my mother. I knew what I was doing. Those Volkers didn't scare me. They're nothing but cowards. I knew how to deal with them. Of course, I never got the chance. I guess Zalbar didn't like seeing me get smacked around. He let out this howl and yanked that Volker a meter up off the ground and held him there by his throat. Uh, what do the other two Volkers do? The other two screamed and ran off. Can't say I blame them. The first time you see an angry Wookiee up close, it isn't a pretty sight. I thought Zalbar was gonna rip that punk's arms off and beat him to death with his own fists. The Volker was so scared, he fainted. Or maybe it was Big Z's breath just knocked him out. Keep telling Zalbar to brush those choppers of his, but he never listens. Just stay up wind when he's speaking and you'll be fine. Anyway, I knew those Volkers would be back with friends, so I grabbed Zalbar and we took off. Ever since then, we've been a team. We look out for each other, you know? Uh, how did Zalbar end up on Terrace? He was fleeing some kind of trouble back on Kashyyyk. That's all I know, really. Big Z doesn't like to talk about it. In case you didn't notice, he's the strong, silent type. Doesn't much matter to me, though. I accept him for what he is, not what he was. He and Zalbar like to live in the present. Uh, how did you survive before you met Zalbar? Hey, what's that supposed to mean? You think I can't take care of myself? I've got street smarts. I know how to get by on my own. In fact, I look out for Zalbar more than he looks out for me, you know? Big Z's a little bit too gullible to make it alone on the mean streets of the lower city. Um, all right, we should get back to the task at hand. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Like I used to tell my brother, fast talk and slick words don't get the job done. I didn't know you had a brother. My brother's a touchy subject, you know. It just so happens, I don't really feel like talking about him right now. Nothing personal. Let's just get back to the business at hand, okay? Alright, fine. Uh, so I don't think we get a note about her. Yeah, no, Karth is the only one that... Karth and then, um... Obviously, like... If you know about any storytelling thing, we're going to get Bastila as a companion. So she's like, those are the only ones that we really get quests for. Um, so we want to come over here to this cage. We'll talk to this outcast healer real quick. Wait, Upworlder. You can't go through this gate. There is too much danger and suffering beyond. For your own sake, turn back. Uh, danger and suffering? What are you talking about? The villagers infected with the Rukgore disease are quarantined beyond this gate. It's only a matter of time until they transform into horrible creatures that would destroy us all. So you just lock them away in a cage? For the sake of the village, we have to keep the infected ones locked away. And when they finally do transform into Rukgores, we'll let them destroy each other. There must be something, I, something someone can do. Nothing can be done for the infected villagers. Even the serum to counteract the Rukgore disease wouldn't be any use now. Nobody would be foolish enough to risk going into the pens to give them the cure. The infected ones could transform into rat ghouls and attack them at any moment. Um, so you'll just leave the infected? No. 
I'm going to go through those gates and try to help the infected ones. I can't stop you from going through the gates, Upworlder. But if the infected ones have already transformed into Ruck Ghouls, you'll be walking into your grave. Alright, so let's go in here. Please, help us. We're infected with the Rat Ghoul disease. At any moment, we could... Uh, no! This cannot... No! <laughs> Seems awful. Nope, they don't want to do that. Nope. We'll do that, and then we'll do flurry. Okay, whatever. Uh, let's switch over to these. Can you... Okay, whatever. What? Yeah. Hey there. What can I... Uh, nothing, never mind. Okay. Why are you not... What the fuck? Alright, that's fine. Time to rumble! Hopefully we should be able to... Seems like... Do it. Yeah, we got a check. It's alright. I think it won't... Hopefully kill us. Huh. Mission Bay went down. Please, please, you have to help us. We beg you. We don't want to end up like the others. Please help us. We can't end up like them. Uh, don't worry, I'm here to help. You, you'll help us? Oh, bless you, Upworlder, bless you. But you must hurry. We have the rat ghoul disease. It is only a matter of time until we are transformed into terrible creatures like those who attacked you when you first came into the pen. It is too late for them. Soon it will be too late for us, and we will transform into those horrible rat ghouls ourselves. Um, don't worry, I'll, I'll be back when I find a cure for you. Please hurry, Upworlder. We don't have much time until the transformation. Don't forget about us, Upworlder. If you find any way to cure this disease, please come back and help us. So let's talk to her do again. You, do you have the cure, Upworlder? Have you come to save us from the horrible fate of the others? Um. Don't worry. Come on. I'm here to help you. You. You'll help us? Oh, bless you. We have the rat. It is too. I thought I have it. Hold on. Goodbye. Don't forget. Do we have to, like, travel away? Um, uh, let's look at our. Where's our inventory? Somewhere on here. Here? There's gotta be something, right? We have a lot of shit we gotta sell. Uh, what was that? Antidote? No, antidote kit. Do we have to buy it off that guy? Alright, game. That's fine. We're gonna switch over to mission. We're gonna put on our... Um, where's her prototype? Are you gonna let me scroll down? There we go. We'll do her vibroblade. Um... I wish, like, they could do the shields themselves. Oh, wow, you're really hurt. I guess we have to go buy it off that guy? Yes. All right, we'll figure that out later. I thought, like, I was trying to save time and just do it now. I don't think they ever turn. Um, there is one other thing. The This crazy old man right here, Rukil, and his apprentice, we have to... His quest, once we turn that into him, of finding his apprentice, because there's two more people we have to find with that which we'll find while looking for Zalbar but when we, when we turn that in we have to uh, where do we want to go we just want to go into a sewer so I guess we'll just go over this way when we turn that in all of those people go like disappear I wish we could like look up and see this but we're obviously like towards the bottom of the world okay we're just going to assume that we got all this so we'll go into the lower sewers so there's a bunch of Gamorrean guards which are pretty fun to kill honestly come on can you do this harsh I'm gonna be able to disable this. Maybe. Okay, good job. I'm proud. Oh yeah, I forgot about rack wheels. I think we'll be fine to handle those rack these rack wheels. Okay. Like honestly, like everyone else. How'd you like that? I think we'll be fine. I gotta see what class um Zalbar is when we get him, because that might depend, depict who we use. Oh, here's a Gamorrean guard. This pig people. Um, I'm gonna try and save 
as much of like the computer spikes and stuff that I can because I don't know I I used to use them all the time in the past I feel like they're kind of a waste like they're kind of nice to use but I don't know I'm not really we'll disable this mine come on so like we could hack that computer but I think I'm just gonna save that for later so I think this is another promised land journal so there's one more we need to get and once we get that we can give them all to Rukil and he will take his people to the promised land um, let's go in this door so there's a lot of Gamorrean guards I think we can handle them though. I'm really not too worried critical strike and let's switch to Karth who will hopefully start power blasting that guy Oh shit. Maybe we do need to use that. I went down. Okay, guess what? We're running away. This is how you win fights in this game. Honestly, this is like the cheapest way, but it works. I think we can leave. If we leave, I'll heal us up and then... This work? I think this works. I think, yeah. Oh, Karth leveled up. So if you level up, their health goes back automatically. Uh, we want this one, so we'll level him up. Skills. I guess... Really treat... And, like, I don't know what else to use for these guys. So feats. He likes blasters and two-handed. Can't do that quite yet. This doubles the critical threat of... Oh, so this is both. Range of... Oh, no, this is just melee attacks. Uh, persuade. We don't care about that. So we just kind of want to do the guns, I guess. Uh, allows you to characters to make an extra range weapon attack during... No. What's this? Melee, heavy, blaster, pist his pistols are pretty good. So let's stick with pistols for him. And I guess we'll just do... This feat triples the critical threat range of range attacks. Let's do this one. We'll add that. Yeah, I think that's all right. So he should be fine. Yes. Let's heal up our character. That's close yeah. enough. And her will use a... Oh, she just has to use two med packs. So really, like, if we want to sure. save... So, like, using the uh, those robots help, but we should, might be all right. There might be guys literally right here. But hopefully they're spaced out. Let's see. Come on. You just... Okay, whatever. I guess he didn't have anything. So yeah, that's kind of like the cheap way of winning everything in this game. Which is, you know, kind of fine, but... See, we spread these guys out pretty easy. It's just like when you get surrounded by enemies that you start to get hurt. So we'll probably do that method a couple times. It's cheap, but, you know, it's what works. 